Hey guys, Tiju22 here, and welcome back to Let's Play Mario Party 9. And so far, I am down by 12 mini stars, but it's not out of the question that I can win, but I can still do this. I just have to concentrate. And the conveyor belt is moving at the direction, in the direction of that arrow. So, the conveyor belt will change direction each time a player hits the dice block. Good to know, actually. Let's see, are we gonna go up or- uh-oh. A bomb bomb is in our vehicle. The counter above the bomb bomb will decrease by one for every space you move. When it reaches zero, boom. When the bomb bomb explodes, whoever is captain will lose half of his or her mini stars. That could be bad for you if you're in the lead, but if you're behind and one of your opponents gets blown up, that could be good. So, this is where the special dice blocks will really come in handy. But first, Wario gets to play an unlucky game. And how many mini star? Well, he's gonna lose one mini star because of that space. So it, it didn't do too much damage, but that's still bad either way. But all right. Okay, I'm the captain next. So if anything, I want to. I'm gonna use this one. I'm gonna use the zero one block. Hopefully, I get a zero. That's the best case scenario. And plus, if you get a zero, you don't get to activate the event of the space that was previously landed on. Of course, I lose three mini stars, but I won't get blown up. At least, not right now. I won't. And Peach, not as stupid as she looks does use the special dice block, and she gets the same one, the special 1-2-3 uh, block. And uh, I think Luigi, Waluigi is in deep trouble. Look what happens. And he, was the, and he was the one in the lead earlier, so that means that he goes from first to third, and now Peach is in the lead, arbitrarily, I might add. Oh yeah, and when you land on those question mark spaces, you actually move from one section to the other. So that's also good. Uh, it depends, you know, when you land and whatnot. Oh, he hit the backspace, so that could help him. And he got more stars. Yeah, mini stars. Yeah. And he gets a dice block. Another person I'd like to give a little shout out to is LP Grotus. He also commented in the first four episodes in the last board. And we get a free for all minigame. But yeah, I, I just want to thank him for commenting as well. I also want to thank YouTube user Pinky and Pookie for also commenting. Very much appreciated. Card smarts. Hmm. Not exactly card sharks. Believe it or not, there was this one game show called Card Sharks. <sighs> Excuse me, I had something in my throat. Card Sharks. It was hosted by Jim Perry and then later Bob Eubanks. But of course the rules were very different from this game. And this game's rules are simply, choose a card from your hand. Play Whoever plays the card with the highest number earns one point. Be the first player to earn three points to win. So there's a lot of strategy involved in this one. So, yeah, you have to, you have to outsmart your opponents in, okay, let's see, I'm gonna play, this one, I guess. 
Oh wait, you can't even press the button to play it. Okay, um... This one, I guess? Yeah, cuz... I want them to use their... higher cards before I start to use them. And Waluigi is winning, so... Gotta use this one. And both me and Peach get it. Um, this one? And I won! Awesome! Oh yeah, um, we still have to play the game to determine second, third, and fourth. And Waluigi gets second, so... I would- oh, okay. Wario got the win. Right? Yeah, he got the win, okay. So, yeah, you just have to play conservatively and only play aggressively when you're behind or if you feel like you're gonna win, so... But then again, if you're playing this with human players, you never know what they're going to play. So you just have to play as strategically as as best as possible. So that's all I have to say about that one. So I'll just roll the dice block as normal. Okay, I get a two. Is that good? Yes, it is good. And I get to go to my own house. Of course, it's a little different, being that we're inside a factory, but... Um, this one? Oh, and I got no item. Okay, well, I mean, it, that's a good one, but I have one too many, so I'll just get rid of one. It, it, it's fine. I, I want to keep one of each one and not have duplicates because, well, different dice blocks will be handy in different situations, so keep that in mind when you play the game. Oh, she keeps... Oh, they keep hitting the backspace. I mean, if they keep this up, uh, this game is going to be longer than it should be, I'll tell you that much. Oh, and they land on the question mark space. Okay, so now we're back on this path. Great. But now Peach is the one that's in the lead, so I'm I'm very concerned right now. At this point. I mean, not too long ago, uh, Waluigi was in the lead, but now... Uh-oh. Another bomb bomb. And, like before, when it blows up, you lose half your mini stars. So let's see which one is... Rivals can't use special dice blocks. Oh, that sucks. So yeah, that's bad, because if you want to use a special dice block, you can't, because it's locked off. So this could hurt somebody. I hope it doesn't hurt me, though. Oh, we get to play a battle minigame. Oh yeah, I almost forgot to mention that Hammer Brother was in the last game as a playable character, and he was pretty cool. I, I actually liked... Hammer Brother. Quite a bit, but... Uh, I'm, I was surprised that, you know, they replaced him with the two mystery characters. I haven't unlocked them yet, but... Anyways, oh, here's the game I screwed up majorly in. And I, I'll tell you one thing, Man... Ma not Man Man, sorry. Man Tar! He laughed at the fact that I failed. And I was like, you laughed at other people's misfortunes? I, and he said, yeah. But... Of course, I know he was just playing around, so I'm not going to get upset with that, about that, so let's just move on. Okay, hopefully I get better than last place, because that's what screwed me up majorly. Ooh, I almost got hit there. I mean, it's, it's kind of like the, those spiky balls kind of bounce off the pegs, just like like Plinko from The Price is Right, you know, the pricing game. Of course, if you don't know what Price is Oh my god! Oh my god! I, I, I was out of room. I was running out of room to run, and... Well, at least I got second place. I wish I would have gotten that in the last game, but... Uh, oh well.
course, I'm still behind majorly by uh, how many how many mini stars am I behind? Quite a bit, actually. Uh, Thirteen to be precise. Okay, since I can't use a special dice block. All right, come on, anything less than a four. Come on, give me less than a four. Less than a four. Come on. Oh, come on! I got a four. Really? And I lose mini stars in, as well. Oh my god. Really? Oh, damn it. I lost 12 of them, and now I'm, I'm definitely in last place, so... Yeah, if the computer players don't screw you, luck will. I mean, I mean, this game, it's mostly, you know, strat it's part strategy, but for the most part, it's luck, so... It's the game where strategy is king and Lady Luck is queen, and right now Lady Luck is treating me like a bitch. And I get to go again. Well, what good is that going to do? Or actually, that might actually give me a chance to play the Captain event, which is that green space with... You'll, you'll see. Let me, uh, let me show you. I forgot to show this last time. Okay, this is the Captain event space. Land here to start a Captain event. This space cannot be skipped. Yeah. So, I need at least a three to get there. I want to be the captain in this case, so... Alright, give me a three. Yes, I got a three. Awesome. And I got those mini stars, so that should definitely help. Quite a bit, actually. Now, I forgot to mention that in the last Captain event, it was just a simple game of reaching the end of Nine Island, and the grand prize was getting those ten mini-stars, but in this case, it's very different. In fact, the Captain event differs from game to game. And there's a lot of mini-stars to be won. And yes, I do want to hear the rules, so I'm going to have Code explain it. Players spill it up, then they take turns hitting a dice block, simultaneously moving forward on their separate paths. When a player lands on an event space, the conveyor belt activates, moving the mini stars one row to the left. The captain should note the locations of the event spaces and mini stars and plan everyone's route accordingly. So... Let's see, I'm probably going to start... Oh, I have to choose from the left onward, so... Um... I'm probably going to choose... Wario, I'll put him in there. Um... Or actually, I should put uh, Peach over here, sorry. I should have put Peach in the number one position, but... Oh, oh well. Uh, I'm going to put myself in this one, the number three position, and... Luigi gets the final round. Alright. Oh, and Wal or Wario gets to go first. Yeah, and by hitting the event space, yeah, they move to the left. So I think I might have accidentally screwed myself, but oh well. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Really? I'm gonna miss out on those stars? Okay, I hope I get... Actually, no. Yeah, I got a 5. And the worst part is, I did not get anything. And Wario got 18. Peach got 18. I didn't get any. And, War and Waluigi didn't get any either. So I, I, I really screwed myself majorly in this one. And we have the almost there event. So I'm gonna I'm gonna take this time to stop the video right here and the current standings as they are right now, Peach has taken a commanding 59 mini star. Uh he, she has fifty-nine mini stars. I 23 star lead over second place, and oh my god, it's gonna take a miracle for me to win. Seriously.
I mean, anything can happen, but I don't like my chances right now. But folks, will I make a comeback? Find out in the next episode. Alright, have a good day, folks.